I am another, my differentness worn on my face, expressed in my every breath, spoken in the stiffness of my spine. You welcome me, but you could not forget if you tried, and nor can I. My mother used to wrestle prickly greens from soil so hard it hurt to dig, where even the simplest act of creation came with sweat and struggle. And there were no silken petals at the end. That was what I called home. That's why I love your milkweed seeds, the promise of new life and long graceful pods on gossamer threads, ready to scatter on the winds in slow motion. They're survivors. The genome of a milkweed plant contains within its ribbons all the milkweed plants that came before. Like them, I made the choice to float away. I serve my home by leaving it. I took to the air and now I thrive in it, despite the fact that it would kill me if I let it. I vibrate with purpose, pointed towards the distant stars where duty is spelled out in endless points of light. I'm a catalog of all my mother's wisdoms and all my father's strengths. The sum total of generations of civilization, of evolution from water to mud to trees to houses and then cities. The refusal to be erased is written on my bones. I'm hard enough to thrive no matter where, even when I plant myself in air, even when I take root in the sky. In a moment of wanton evolution, I am reckless enough or brave enough to be the next stage. We sometimes forget that to grow, even the hardest seeds crack open. To put down roots, they must soften, mingle with what surrounds them, release their strings of tissue full of DNA, share the sacred code passed down through millennia. Your welcome gives me fertile soil where my otherness takes root where my loneliness is eased by cracking open, by growing, blooming, manifesting the hundred generations as they culminate in me.